25 best places to visit in Africa post COVID-19. Hello Displorers, welcome back to another exciting video presented to you by Displo and thanks for watching. In this video, we shall be taking you on a tour across the beautiful continent of Africa, showing you the 25 best places to visit in Africa. Africa is one of the most beautiful continents on earth, although it may not always be registered on the average international travel's radar. But then, those who visit have the chances to experience the perfect blend of ancient and modern of wild and urban east and west. With the coming of the coronavirus pandemic, which put the entire world on a standstill, the number of people who visited Africa just like the rest of the world in 2020 drastically reduced. We are hopeful for the tourism industry around Africa as more and more countries have reopened their borders and are now ready to receive visitors. So if you're looking forward to visiting Africa within this 2021, we have compiled a list of the 25 best places to visit in Africa. Coming out with this list was extremely difficult considering the numerous travel destinations options the continent provides. If you're new here, welcome. Be sure to subscribe and turn on notifications so you don't miss any of our videos. So without any further delay, here are 25 best places you can visit in Africa, of course in no particular order. 25. Cape Verde Archipelago Officially known as the Republic of Cabo Verde, Cape Verde is a country located in the North Atlantic and consisting of 10 islands. The Cape Verde Archipelago is a cultural blend of African, Iberian and Brazilian influences. From water sports and hikes through volcanic landscapes to leisure times at the scenic beaches, Cape Verde offers it all. If you make it there, between February and March, the annual Cape Verde Carnival in the cultural capital of São Vicente is a must-see. Cape Verde is definitely one destination you should visit this year. Number 24. Mauritius Mauritius appeals to vacationers in search of a bit of everything. Though its main draws are its powdery sands and luxurious resort, this small island nation east of Madagascar equally charms visitors with its French colonial architecture, friendly locals and tasty teas and rooms. After a day of exploring and soaking up some sun, retreat to one of the island's premier proctors to savour fresh seafood while watching a traditional Sega dance performance or the sunset over the Indian Ocean. 23. Kruger National Park Situated roughly 260 miles northeast of Johannesburg, the nearly 5 million acre Kruger National Park offers some of the best assets to wild animals in Africa. The big five, buffalo, elephants, leopards, lions and rhinos all reside here, as well as now crocodiles, hippos and rare birds like southern ground hornbills and lapid-faced vultures. But this prowling wildlife sanctuary is home to more than just animals. Giant baobab, fever and marula trees tower above the park savanna, thorn veld and woodland landscape. What's more, Kruger's marula and Zagzateni regions house the Albacini and Masurini ruins where Portuguese colonists and members of the indigenous Ba Paloboa ethnic group once traded metal products, beads, cloaks and more. Number 22. Marrakech Like other historic Moroccan cities, Marrakech burses with life. Performers long for your attention in Gemma El Fna, an open-air square in the heart of the Medina of Marrakech. While vendors hawk aromatic spices, homemade textiles, ornate lanterns and more at the bazaars along the alleyways. When you need a break from the hustle and bustles of the city, unwind at a haman or head to a bar and relax. During your visit, keep an ear out to hear the striking tones of the nearby mosque's calls to pray. Number 21. Masai Mara National Reserve Home to cheetahs, elephants, lions, wild beasts, hippos and more, Masai Mara National Park Reserve is one of Kenya's premier spots to see wildlife. Sign up for a safari experience to explore these protected areas, 371,200 acres of rolling grasslands. For an extra dose of adventure, opt for a horseback or a hot air balloon safari. To increase your chances of sporting the big five, the lions, leopards, rhinos, elephants and buffaloes, and other migrating animals, time your visit between July and October. 20. Madagascar The habitat on the islands of Madagascar is unlikely any other in the world. Most of the landscape is unspoiled, giving visitors a chance to see animals in their natural environment. Make sure to snap a photo of the signature animal, the lemu. Madagascar is home to more than 100 species of these creatures, as well as 19,000 plus kinds of plants. Some of the best places to see wildlife lemurs include Izalo National Park and Lokobi National Park. Number 19. Luxor Cairo's pyramids may steal most of the spotlight, but ancient Egypt's aficionados know not to overlook Luxor. 
Perhaps the most pressing reason to visit the UNESCO World Heritage City is to tour the Valley of the Kings, where at least 63 ancient pharaohs, including King Tut, are entombed. Many monuments and tombs found here date back to the 14th century BC, including mossy sites like the Temple of Luxor and the Colossi of Meno. Number 18. Namibia Other worldly landscapes await you in postcards worthy Namibia. In this southern African country, you discover the eerily beautiful Namib, the world's oldest desert, plus animal field national parks and beaches overlooking shipwreck filled waters. When you're not exploring the striking red dunes of Susuzvlai or the dead camel thorn tree filled dead vale, both of which can be found in the Namib, look for rhinos in Etosha National Park and enjoy an off road tour of the skeleton coast. Also, save time for experiencing the European flair found in Namibia's former colonial towns, such as Luderitz and Swakopmund. 17. Serengeti National Park If you're enamored with the prospect of coming face to face with the elephants, giraffes, zebras and wildebeest, then a safari through Tanzania Serengeti National Park is the perfect adventure for you. The price will be steep, but a journey here affords an unforgettable experience. To save some coins, book one of the park's campgrounds instead of staying at a high-end safari lodge. Plan on arriving in January, February or between June and September for the best game viewing conditions. 16. Seychelles A grouping of 115 islands in the Indian Ocean, the Seychelles has long attracted those looking for a truly relaxing getaway. Spend your days lounging on pristine, crowd-free beaches like Anza Volbert and Anza Lazio, or head deep into the UNESCO World Heritage listed Valle de May Nature Reserve to gaze at its unique flora and fauna. Keep in mind that lodging here is expensive, especially at the luxury resorts, so it's best to save up and book in advance. 15. African Renaissance Monument At 49 meters (160 feet tall, the African Renaissance Monument in Senegal, which is higher than the Statue of Liberty in New York, is the tallest statue in Africa. Getting to the top is an exhilarating fear that's crowned by the breathtaking view of Dakar from the top of the monument. We have dedicated a video on the African Renaissance Monument of this channel, which you can watch by clicking the card on the screen. 14. Sources Fly Dunes, Namibia Sources Vlai means the gathering place of water, but you need to bring your own if you don't want to dehydrate at this, Namibia's most outstanding attraction. The dunes have developed over millions of years, the result of material flowing from the Orange River into the Atlantic, carried north and returned again to the land by the surf. Climbing the dunes yields breathtaking views, including the dead fly, a ghostly expanse of dried white clay punctuated by skeletons of ancient camel horned trees. Number 13. Zanzibar Zanzibar offers something for everyone, whether you're in search of beautiful beaches or an unforgettable adventure. After trekking to this Indian Ocean destination off the eastern coast of Africa, you will instantly feel at ease as you lounge on quiet beaches like Matemwe and Pongwe. Once you've gotten your feel of the archipelago's beaches, visit Zanzibar City's UNESCO World Heritage listed Stone Town, where you'll find the ruins of a 15th century palace and a graveyard with ties to Zanzibar's former Arab royals. No trip would be complete without taking a spice tour in the countryside and exploring Josani Chuaka Bay National Park. Number 12. Victoria Falls Outdoorsy types travel far and wide to admire the breathtaking UNESCO World Heritage Site. Straddling the border between Zambia and Zimbabwe, Victoria Falls is roughly twice as deep and wide as Niagara Falls, making it one of the world's impressive waterfalls. To see the natural wonder at its prime, plan a visit here in April, when the area's rainy season has concluded. Popular vantage points include the Knife Edge Bridge, Livingstone Island and Devil's Pool. When you're not enjoying the view from above, go swimming or whitewater rafting in the Zambezi River to admire the falls from a different angle. 11. Nyika Plateau National Park, Malawi Nyika, the largest national park in Malawi, is one of the most unusual in Africa, with a plateau cut by numerous rivers that reach Lake Malawi by way of waterfalls off the eastern edge of the mountains. The eastern border of the plateau forms the wall of the Great Rift Valley. The great domes of hills have gentle slopes, making Yika perfect for both trekking and mountain biking as well as jeep exploration. Antelope and zebra abound, and the park has one of the highest densities of leopards in Central Africa. Number 10. Magadigadi Pants, Botswana It's said that you can hear your own blood flow in this vast area of dried up salt pans in the Kalahari Desert, a forbidding landscape formed by a huge lake that dried up millennia ago but it can transform in an instant during winter. 
If rains have been good enough to make loose grass sprout, bringing a stampede of wildlife to break the silence including zebra, wildebeest and flamingos. Number 9. Mountain Gorillas, Rwanda A close encounter with the mountain gorillas of the Rwandan rainforest will stay with you for a lifetime. Various operators run tours tracking silverbacks and their troops in the dense forest. At an elevation of more than 6,000 feet, the Nyungwe National Park is an isolated region covering more than 386 square miles across southwest Rwanda. Tourists can meet a vast range of primates and also traverse East Africa's highest canopy. Number 8. Gemma El Fna, Morocco The world's most exciting town square, Gemma El Fna, reminds you you're in Africa. In the heart of the old city of Marrakech, snake charmers, henna painters, storytellers, date sellers and orange juice vendors set up their stores in the sleepy heat of the afternoon. At night falls, the vendors are joined by tribal drummers, ladyboy dancers, and mobile restaurants selling delicious grilled meats, bread and salad as the smoke rises above their stalls till past midnight. Number 7. Cape Town With numerous hiking trails, miles of dramatic scenery, and stunning beaches, including the ones with wild penguins, Cape Town caters to both adventurous type and laid-back travelers. Getting here won't be cheap, but it is possible to find convenient, budget-friendly lodging. Make sure you take the aerial cable way up Table Mountain, visit Nelson Mandela's jail cell on Robben Island, explore the world-renowned Constantia Valley wine region and attend one of the city's many festivals. Number 6. Virunga National Park, DR Congo Near the eastern border of the Democratic Republic of the Congo and just minutes away from Uganda is the Virunga National Park. Virunga was founded in 1925 by the Belgian King Albert and it was Africa's very first national park. While poaching was a serious problem in the park in the past, now it is a growing tourism destination. The Virunga National Park is most famous for its mountain gorillas, but you can also see the Tongo chimpanzees or even trek to the summit of the Nirangongo volcano to see the world's largest lava lake glowing. Number 5. Mount Kilimanjaro, Tanzania In the far north of Tanzania, close to the Kenyan border, is the famed Mount Kilimanjaro. The peak is the tallest in Africa and the tallest freestanding mountain in the world, making it a bucket list destination for many travelers. While the very feet can trek to the summit of Mount Kilimanjaro, there are also other ways to explore the area. There are several shorter, easier hikes around the base of the mountain, along with some gorgeous waterfalls and plenty of amazing scenery. Number 4. Lalibela, Ethiopia The city of Lalibela in Ethiopia is known as a city of pilgrimage. Lalibela boasts 11 monolith rock cut churches, each of which is fascinating to explore. Most residents are Egyptian Orthodox Christians, and most of the churches were constructed in the 12th and 13th centuries. If you only have time for a tour of one of the churches in Lalibela, make it Bet Giyogis, which is shaped like a cross and carved entirely from rock in a spectacular fashion. Number 3. Jen, Mali Probably the most historically and architecturally interesting city in all of Mali is Jen. The city served as an important element of the Trans-Saharan gold trade and it still is a regional hub thanks to its impressive weekly market that gathers residents from all the surrounding areas. By far the most amazing landmark in the city, however, is the Great Mosque, which is the largest mud brick building in the world. The Islamic mosque dates back to the 13th century, although it wasn't officially completed until 1907. Number 2. Bwindi Impenetrable National Park, Uganda If you're interested in seeing rare wildlife, then the Bwindi Impenetrable National Park in Uganda should definitely be on your itinerary for an African adventure. With a permit from the Ugandan Wildlife Authority, you can hike from the two hops of Buhoma to Ngoringo and Kaya on gorgeous lakes. The main attraction, however, is tracking gorillas. The Bwindi Impenetrable Forest is one of the best places in the world to see mountain gorillas in their natural habitat. Number 1. Cairo Cairo can be overwhelming as there's so much to see and do everywhere you turn, from Islamic Cairo's bustling Khan El Khalili Bazaar to the ancient pyramids of Giza to the picturesque Nile River, you'll be immersed in this Egyptian city's history and culture before long. Though winter offers the most pleasant weather of the year, think daytime temps in the upper 60s, it's also the busiest season, so consider visiting in spring or fall when room rates are lower and attraction crowds thin out. There you have it, Displorers. Those are the 25 best places to visit in Africa this 2021. Thanks for watching this video and do not forget to like and subscribe.